Hi, this is Camille, and today we're going to make a cold tortellini salad. This is something good to make. You can have it for dinner. It's got a little meat in it. Or you can have it as a cold lunch, something to take to work. It's great in the summer for those backyard barbecues. So here's a few items we're going to put in there. I, already, I went ahead and made the tortellini just to save us some time. You know how to make pasta. You boil the water, you put the pasta in. When the tortellini floats to the top, stir them up and test one. If they're soft, they're done. And then rinse them right away with cold water. Drizzle a little olive oil on there, stir it up, and just let it sit while you get your other ingredients ready. I chopped up some carrots, red pepper, you can use green pepper too if you like. The color, the more color the better, the more appetizing it looks. Chopped garlic, because you know I put garlic in most everything. Some pepperoni, and this is how I buy the pepperoni. I go to the deli and I tell them, I want a piece of pepperoni about this thick. And they might look at you kind of funny, but they will go ahead and cut it because I want chunks of pepperoni. I want to taste it. I don't want to buy those thinly sliced ones and you bite into it and it tastes like nothing. And so I'm just going to cut them. So I got a nice little chunk in my mouth. That's, this is where the flavor comes from. See that? You can put more, you can put less. Say you like salami instead of pepperoni. Pepperoni's got a little bit of a spicy bite to it. If you want salami, use that. Whatever you like. I like the Caesar dressing. You can use Italian. Whatever you like. You can make it oriental. Use chopped chicken instead of the pepperoni. I like to shake a little cheese on there. If you got Parmesan, use that. I actually have the fresh shredded Parmesan. I'm gonna use that today. And then I'm going to make this an Italian tortellini salad. So I got out my uh, Italian seasonings. It could be oregano and basil. This one happens to be a Tuscan mix. So now we're going to put all these ingredients together. Nice big bowl. In goes my tortellinis. Do you see how I got the tricolored? I'm going to put in my carrots. Red pepper. Little or a lot of garlic. If you don't like the fresh garlic, don't use it. Use what you like. Some people like fresh onion. In goes my pepperoni. Now as far as the seasoning goes, you choose the amount. I'm just going to sprinkle about a quarter teaspoon in there. I'm going to take a little bit of my shredded Parmesan for the mix and save a little bit for the presentation. Just drizzle a little bit of dressing so everything gets mixed up. And just use something big like this or even just a plain spatula to toss it. You don't want to big you don't want to tear the tortellinis up. So make sure you have something that's just going to toss it a little bit, even some tongs. Now that little bit of dressing is going to keep this tortellini from sticking together. So when I'm ready to serve, when the guests are here, then I add a little bit more dressing on the top. Let's move it around a little bit because when they dig into it with the spoon, it's going to distribute it. And it looks so much creamier like that, doesn't it? And then I'm going to sprinkle a little more of my Parmesan. Look at that. Now this is what's for dinner.